Hi everyone, my name is Akasha and today's video is going to be an Ipsy versus Boxy video because I finally got both of them in the bigger size, I don't know what to call it. I think Ipsy is like Ipsy VIP or Ipsy something something and then this one, I don't even really know, okay I'm, I'm stupid. So I know I look like a mess but I just got home from work and put on like pajamas. Just want to compare the two while I still can before it's too late because I know I upload these way too late. So I'm going to try to get through this very quickly because I already know what's in here because um, they give you the spoilers and BoxyCharm doesn't give you spoilers so I just kind of ripped the box open but it says to you from you and it has a little thumb in it and it says feel the love and you can win a Valentine's Day gift. And then we have this, I already know what it is, it's by Dominique Cosmetics and it's the Sweater Weather um, Eyeshadow Palette. I'm going to zoom in on everything um, just because I don't want to come in and like have my camera like, refocus and everything. So this is the Sweater Weather Palette. There are six colors in here. Next. I think these are the brushes. I was really excited for these because they let you choose one product. Um, so it's my first time choosing and I wanted to choose the brushes, but I ended up choosing the Murad Sunscreen. Yeah, Essential Sea Day Moisture Broad Spectrum. And it's SPF 30 PA++. Apparently I think that's like the second best, right? Isn't it like PA++? And there's PA++++, but this is what it looks like. And I'm definitely going to be wearing these because I need to wear a sunscreen more and I'm actually using um, the Morphe and like eyeliner and stuff that they've sent before. I'm wearing the Morphe right now as well. So just so you guys know, I am using these things when they come in. Um, the things that I am not using, I went ahead and gave to my sister and pe random people, my mom, etc. Because um, if I'm not going to use it, I'd rather somebody be able to use it. This is the bag that they sent for February. Um, I think it's really cute. It's like a purplish pinky color. I'm sorry if you guys can't see that well. And it says Ipsy on the inside and it's like this pretty like maroon purple color. Yeah? Yeah? Okay! My dad asked me if I want guac. Now, I'm excited for these brushes. So this is LaRousse and I'm just going to go ahead and open it. I know I'm opening this very messy, but it's not like I'm going to keep this, this little thing. So there's an angle contour brush, and these look really pretty, like the handles are so nice. And I'm trying to get through this fast because my battery is dying on my camera right now. So there's an angle brush, a shadow brush, a kabuki brush, flat foundation brush, and a tapered blending brush really cute and the last thing they sent is this Il Maquillage eyeliner so I don't know about you guys but I've seen so many Il Maquillage ads on um, Instagram it's a felt tip one and it's pretty black you know standard eyeliner I've already received like three eyeliners all together between Boxy and Ipsy now, I think. That's everything that came in Boxy, so I'm kind of excited about that. Um, you know, Il Maquillage, I've always seen the ads online and everything, so we'll see how that goes with that. Prices of everything, like what it's actually valued at. So the Murad sunscreen is 65, the Il Maquillage eyeliner is 21, the Dominique Cosmetics Sweather Weather, Weather eyeshadow palette is 29, Wait, something's missing. There's literally something missing. It's the um, Touch and Soul Pretty Filter Soul Velvet Lipstick in Soul Rose, but that value is at $16. I'll try to reach out to them about that and I'll let you guys know what they say, but as for now, I'm just gonna go ahead and open the BoxyCharm box and see what we've got here. That's so weird to me, like maybe it like fell out or maybe they forgot to put, put it in the box, I don't know. I don't see how it would fall out. Um, I don't think I dropped it anywhere. I don't see it. So here's what we have with BoxyCharm. I have no idea what they sent me because they don't send you spoilers. Okay, let's see what we have here. 
more brushes. I'm excited for that. Oh, I don't know what this is, but it's a primer, a correcting primer by the brand P-U-R. It looks, I want to say pure because it has the umlaut on the top. If you take or know German, you know that they put umlauts on top to use. Then we have facial radiance pads. This is, this is twice daily after cleansing. It's a help exfoliate and tone brighten pads. Oh, it smells good. I think they're like makeup pads, kind of almost, to get makeup and stuff off. And there's like a bunch of them in here. I like that. We have the Touch and Soul Pretty Filter Glassy Skin Balm. I like the packaging, it's very like... And then it says glassy on there. I don't know if you guys can see it. Am I holding it upside down? Oh wow, it's like... It's like a cream in there. It smells really good. It smells like something my mom used to use. Um, this one lotion. Then we have Kate Somerville KX Active Concentrates Biomimicking Peptide Smooth and Firm Serum. It says how to use AM PM apply one to two drops onto cleansed skin. So I, and it's cruelty free. So I guess it helps you look younger, smooth and firm your skin out. They sent me a lot of skincare. I don't think they sent me like any makeup because this is skincare, 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 and then uh, primer. <laughs> and uh, oh no, that's my other thing. And brushes. So this is the biomimicking peptides. Oh wow. This smells okay. I'm gonna try all these products out tonight, maybe tomorrow as well. Um, I'm just more so wor worried, not wonder worried, uh, wondering what happened with the lipstick that they sent. And I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. Um, let me know what you guys like better. I really do like BoxyCharm better. I feel like. They send me like better things a lot of the time, but I also like that with Ipsy you can choose one of the things. Um, it's also just weird that one of the things went missing because if this was like my actual first Ipsy box, I'd be wondering what happened. This is my first time getting a um, Ipsy whatever the size box is though, but the rest of the times I've gotten the smaller sample size ones. So now I'm kind of just wondering what happened with the lipstick. I was kind of looking forward to that one. So we'll see what happens after I contact them. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know which one you like the best. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Hopefully next week, the week after. I've been trying to upload more. I don't know if you guys can tell. And if you like this video, just give it a thumbs up. Subscribe, you know, whatever is your jam. Okay, thank you.